An armed robbery turned high speed chase turned deadly shootout. The crazy chain of events happened this morning near Picacho Peak. Now, on your side, Simone Del Rosario explains how it all went down. Well, Stella, a convicted felon is dead, and his partner in crime is in the hospital after officials say they shot at the deputy who chased them down, and the deputy fired back. The first infraction happened after deputies say two suspects walked into an adult store in Picacho Peak right off Interstate 10. Officials say they held the female attendant at gunpoint, then tied her up in the back room and took off with money from the cash register and the entire safe. She was able to free herself and call 911. A veteran deputy spotted an Audi car speeding off on Interstate 10 just four minutes after the call. Officials say he tried pulling the car over, but instead the suspect sped up to around 120 miles per hour before turning off onto Highway 87. The chase ended when officials say the men rammed the Audi head on into the deputy squad truck, then jumped out and started shooting at him. The deputy fired back, killing one suspect and striking the other in the arm and leg. Officials found the adult boutique safe in the car, and after IDing both men, discovered their past criminal records. Now, 32 year old Matthew Clowers here on the left, who died on scene, got out of prison back in 2009 after serving 10 years for aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and armed robbery. 23 year old Adam Chavez here got out of prison last year after serving eight months for endangerment and theft. No word yet on charges from Chavez, or for Chavez from today's events.